Sunday night, March 14th, near the center of the site, a significant construction milestone took place. The first major concrete pour for the waste solidification building. Yeah, tonight we're making the first structural concrete placement for our waste solidification building base mat. It's a major milestone in the project. Uh, we've been working several months to get to this point. Uh, it gives us the opportunity to move forward with the walls and get this building uh, you know, dried in and built up the rest of the way. The Waste Solidification Building, or WSB, is scheduled to go online in 2013. When complete, it will process three liquid waste streams from the MOX fuel fabrication facility and the pit disassembly and conversion facility into solid waste forms acceptable for shipment and final disposal. Plans are to employ about 100 operations personnel. The Waste Solidification Building is an integral part for the NNSA mission here at the Savannah River site. And it's important for the uh, team at SRNS to uh, demonstrate that we can uh, successfully and safely do the work on, on cost and on schedule. Uh, it's the largest concrete placement we've had. Uh, it's a major activity that we've been working to and trying to build towards. Uh, so there's, there's a lot of people that's happy to see it pulled off. The concrete pour took about 15 hours to place and finish and was a safe, successful and significant event with over 750 cubic yards of concrete poured.